This is the Cage Gallery, the first one we're going to look at today. Currently, it features artists from around the world who use art as a tool for social change. Our exhibitions turn over frequently though, so every term you're bound to see something new. It's a good reason to come visit often. This next gallery is usually reserved for student curated shows. So next we have Kim Gallery, which usually features ancient art. Our best known are the Assyrian reliefs. They once lined the palace of King Ashurnasirpal II. This gallery was curated by Professor Alan Hockley, who's the chair of the art history department. Professor Hockley teaches a class exclusively in the hood on Japanese prints. They meet in the Bernstein Center for Object Study, where they get to look at art up close and discuss it further. The museum works with over 30 departments and programs to create direct experiences with original works of art. The Hood just hired a new associate curator of global contemporary art and she has a lot of exciting projects and works. So this is a great option for us to show more art when wall space is limited. Did you know the Hood has over 65,000 objects in the collection? Artists featured in this gallery recently visited campus, right? That's right. We had two indigenous contemporary Australian artists come to campus to talk with a few classes, with a student club, and to give a lecture as well. So currently we have two installations dedicated to Native American art. Our collection includes over 4,000 works by indigenous peoples across the United States, Canada, and Greenland. I love being involved with the arts on campus, but I'm also a government major and I'm on the Dartmouth women's rugby team. As a Dartmouth student, you don't have to limit yourself to one aspect of campus. That's right, we want all students to feel connected to the museum, whether you're an art history major or even never been to a museum before. The Hood is always free to students, and students from all majors and backgrounds can apply to our programs. Whether you want to come to the museum for five hours or five minutes, this is your museum. Make sure to visit our website to learn what's on view, what events we have coming up, and how you can get involved. We'd love to see you here.